Hey guys, what's going on? It's Lens here, and today we have another review for you. What do we have here today? We have the High Waisted Power Soft Leggings from Old Navy. Now, Old Navy leggings, I haven't tried a lot. I'm gonna let you know, are they worth it or are they not? Before I get into it, don't forget, I link everything up below when you shop directly from my links. It does help support my channel, and I appreciate that so much. I went ahead and went with the navy-ish color. It's called Dusk Navy. They also have an amazing underwater color, which is kind of like a sea foam green blue color. And then they have black. So I went ahead and went with my normal sizing, a size medium. And as soon as I pulled these out of the packaging, I was like, okay, I think these are going to fit. I think we're good to go here. And I was very surprised with how soft these are. And I really like the athletic material in these. I can see myself squatting in these going on walks and helping me stay cool so it's not super heavy if that makes sense so as soon as i got them on they fit like a glove even the length of these and the cool thing about these leggings from old navy they come with regular tall or petite and we love that we love the options and i went ahead and got the regular length in these leggings so does this pass the high waistband test? To be honest, I was a little concerned with looking at it before I put it on. Yes, it does. It actually hits well above the belly button. We do kind of have a seam at the top. It's not seamless at the top of that, but I like that because sometimes it helps prevent it, the leggings from falling down, especially when they're like silky, like these ones are. We do have one seam in the front. I had no issues in the nether regions down there. And then we also have a gusset. This gusset is going to be double layered, okay? Then we have one seam on the inside of the leg. I like to kind of inspect the seams of leggings and these kind of remind me of the Lululemon seams, how they are done. So I think they would hold up pretty well. Now, as we move to the side, we have a little surprise for you. We have pockets. These are pocket leggings and these are pretty big pockets. I love that, especially for the summertime. You know, maybe we're going to the zoo, maybe we're going to the park. We have pockets on both sides where we can fit our phone. And the other side, you could put a granola bar, put some snacks in on the other side and be good to go. You don't have your hands full. I love that. And the one thing I do like about these pockets is that, like I said, they are good size. They're not small. You're gonna be able to fit a good amount in them. We don't have any pockets then inside the waistband. So no pockets inside the waistband, which if you're like comparing something to Lululemon, they have pockets in the waistband. These do not. Now, as we flip around to the back, something else that I was really surprised about with these Old Navy leggings is they do actually have a slight V up above the glutes. It's not super drastic like a buff bunny, okay? Or we don't have the scrunch bum back here, okay? but we have a slight V and I really thought it did a nice job accentuating the glutes in a conservative way. And plus this is a navy color, which I really like that it gives a little color, but it's nothing too crazy. So I really like the glutes in these leggings and I was really surprised because again, it's Old Navy. And then we do have the Old Navy logo on the back. It's going to be silver reflective like you would get with a Lululemon logo. Overall, with these Old Navy leggings, I felt held in. I was surprised with how also stretchy they were around my legs, so they really formed to my body, which I loved, and I didn't feel restricted. I could definitely wear these leggings all day long and not want to like peel them off of me because they're so restrictive. And for the price point, I feel like you cannot beat it. These are a go for me. I'm going to go ahead and link them up below. If you do have any questions, please drop them in the comments. I'm happy to answer. Until next time, we'll talk to you guys later.